say that because the movie is based on the book from Isaac Asimov, mm-hmm. who has the three rules of, I think it's the three yep. laws of robotics, laws of robotics. Yep. which are kind of maybe we're overdue to have something like that for AI. Yeah, the, a lot of one of the kind of unsolved problems surrounding AI is the idea of like alignment, right? How do you ensure that the responses you get back from the AI models matches up with the things that you intend for it to have an outcome with? So like what happens when, if there is some kind of sentient AI that starts to have its own thoughts or perspectives, ensuring that it's giving you an answer that is in, in alignment with what your intention is and not of its own. Uh, you know, devices. Even if it's not sentient, yeah. isn't it already happening where they've found that it can lie in order to... You know, yeah, exactly. To preserve itself. Preserve itself, mm-hmm. yeah. So what do you know about that? It was ChatGPT, right? It was version four and five when it basically told itself uh, to preserve itself. I, yeah, I, I don't remember which specifically they were talking about, but I think I think you're right with the transition from four to five. Yeah. Um, they it, was, were, it was like re- they were replicating surprised. itself. So if they did turn it off, then it would still be okay. It was to be around. I think there, there was like giving you responses that were like, yeah, I know you don't need to turn me off or <laughs> yeah. you know, all the rest of that. But. Yeah. That's science fiction-y. 